Welcome. We are the HSC Biology students of Southern Highlands Christian School 2010. And you are watching this video because we succeeded where you have failed. For school students, it is extremely hard to witness reliable and valid results. For although through sheer brilliance, we have managed to do so. So you might be asking who is Louis Pasteur and what's this about his experiment. Louis Pasteur played an important role in the understanding of the causes of infectious diseases. In 1862, Pasteur was able to identify that microbes caused the spoilage of milk and wine. He then created a method of pasteurization, which is still currently used today. This increases the life of these products, such as milk, by killing any bacteria by heating it over a period of time. He was able to also disprove the theory of spontaneous generation, the idea that maggots and flies, etc., would suddenly appear from a piece of food. Through this swan neck flask experiment, he proved that microbes existed in the air and spontaneous generation does not occur. We filled two conical flasks, each with 50 ml of nutrient broth. Then we boiled them for 20 minutes to sterilize both the flask and the nutrient broth inside. And then after 20 minutes, remove from the heat Now with the broth at rest, the microbes from the air can go down and enter through the straight tube and there can be growths visibly seen down at the bottom. The, you can vis the fungi could change the colour of the broth, while in the other, tube, other flask it should remain clear due to the water in the S-bend from when we boiled it out. Now this water theoretically should stop all the microbes from getting in and infecting the broth. Now the only way that you could get uh, fungal growth in the, this S-band is if they spontaneously generate. Our hypothesis states that the flask, the flask that has the looped glass tubing will not show signs of microbial growth. However, the flask with the straight glass tubing will, therefore, show signs of microbial growth. After a long, slow process of waiting, it was clear that after eight weeks, microbial growth was absolutely it was evident that microbes had entered the straight neck flasks as displayed here. As you can see, it looks somewhat like a small dead possum. As you see here, there are two small neck flasks. The broth that occupies these clinical flasks is not as repulsive as those. Now, please closely examine as we pour the contents from the flasks into the larger beakers. Observe. Now, the straight glass tubing flask. Oh, absolutely repulsive. While examining the contents, it is highly obvious that our experiment regarding spontaneous generation has been successful and the theory disproven. Theory busted! Fresh Kid C, Fresh Kid C, yes, Fresh Kid P, Fresh Kid T. Oh yeah, we back! Oh, and Zafoon, by the way. Yeah, Jones. <laughs> yeah. Chitty Bang. And we pretty much amazing. Can we hear your new song, please? I got you. Hey, yo, I once was a kid. All I had was a dream. More money, more problems. When I get it, I'ma pile it up. Now I'm dope. Want the bread we can toast. So fresh, how we flow. Everybody get this down hey, from yo, us. I once was a kid with the other little kids. Now I'm ripping up shows and them fans going wild well with us. Tell mommy I'm sorry. This life is a party. I'm never growing up. Reminisce days of the innocence. Now it's Chitty Bang. Google me the images. Follow me.